Welcome, football fans, to New Orleans, Louisiana. I'm Dave Stevens. By my side is football analyst Mike Steele. I'm looking at coaching staffs today, Dave. Two coaches who aren't afraid to play ball. Deep passes, trick plays, jailbreak blitzes. We're sure to see them all today. Yeah, Mike, I think we've seen this before. Let's go ahead and get down to the action. That will bring up second down. Zings it. And he can't reel it in. Games are won and lost on third down. Go! That brings up fourth down. That's a smart play call. You were in a bad position on third down. Take a few yards and live to fight another day. Drake takes the kick. Makes the return up to the 32. Drake. Passes one to the back. Blue 26. Blue 26. A penalty marker on the play. Snyder grabs the ball out of the air. Let's see how the penalty affects things. Dallas elects to decline the penalty. Great anticipation by the quarterback to throw it where the receiver needed to be. The next with number 46. A good first down for the defense is an incomplete pass or a short run, not another first down. I guess they didn't get the memo. Louisiana takes the penalty. Move them back a few more yards. You can console the guys at teammate all you want, but it's going to frustrate those guys. Uncorks this one near the middle of the field. Some throws require touch and some require zip. That, my friend, was a rocket shot. He sends one. He can't make the catch. I sure hope this receiver doesn't like sitting because that's what he'll be doing soon if he continues to drop crucial passes like that. Rockets one to the end zone. Incomplete. As a coach, you hope your players have the ability to get past the mistakes they've made and execute the next time they're in that situation. It'll sail just inside the uprights. Dallas takes the initial lead. Three, nothing. The home team falls behind with that early field goal and will look to tie or pull ahead with their next drive. Schwartz takes the kickoff. After a return of 34, the offense has a great opportunity to get back out in front of this ball game on this drive. A penalty marker on the play. The pass falls harmlessly to the ground. Well, we'll see if that holds up after the penalty. Dallas will accept the penalty. The refs have shown they're letting them play today, Dave, but when it's that blatant, it's getting a flag. Throws one up beyond, and it's picked off by the defense. Hansen was in the right place at the right time for that interception. The away team has a one possession lead going into the drive. Let's see what they can do with it. Number 46 on the carry. That will move the chains. Soto handing it off. Eventually dragged down at the 12 yard line. That'll bring up a fresh set of downs. As good as advertised, Dave. We expected to see some great offense today, and it's coming around. Makes the toss to number 46. Missed tackle. And he scores! You could tell the defense respected the offense's ability to throw smart passes. That run caught them by surprise a bit, and they weren't able to prevent the touchdown. The first quarter comes to an end. The lawmen up so far. Ten, nothing. The kick is off. Schwartz takes the kick. Tackled after a return of 36. The home team has dug themselves into quite a hole here. They've got a chance to regain some of that on this drive. Eventually dragged down. That'll be enough for the first down. 
That was a great run there to pick up the first down. He rifles one. And it's intercepted. He's taken down by Schwartz. I'm sure the coaches had talked to him about this one with him all week. Just a bad read exploited by the secondary. It will be interesting to see if the offense can do anything on this drive following that turnover. The QB makes the toss. That will move the chains. He takes the ball. Dallas with two tight ends. Soto looking to pass. That brings up third down. These third and short downs are big downs for both sides of the ball. Pulled in by number 46. First down. First and ten. Uncorks this one close to the line of scrimmage near the middle of the field. Incomplete. Soto back to pass. He rockets a pass. And he's brought down up near the four yard line. Louisiana will use their first time out here. First down. Second down. Soto looking to pass. Zings one. The tackle is made at the eight yard line. Louisiana takes their last time out. Quarterback to pass. Incomplete. When it's third and long, sometimes you've got to throw it downfield even when you know that's exactly what the defense is expecting. It just didn't work out for them at that time. Here comes the kicking team. There looks to be an injury down on the field. Flores kicks a deep one into the end zone. Schwartz takes the kick. Makes the return up to the 31-yard line. It needs to be go time for the offense. They need to stop messing around. Tighten up your chin strap and get ready to drive the ball down the field. Handing it off to number 22. That brings up second down. Complete to number 28. First down. Steps into the pocket. Coming with pressure. And he misses his mark. Pitches it out to number 22. That will move the chains. It's runs like that, Dave, that helps set the tone for this game. Nothing fancy, just our guys beat your guys. Number nine gives it away. That will bring up third down. Number nine drops back. It's caught by number 10. That will move the chains. Second down. Third down. I think that's a good call by the coach. There's still a lot of game left, and you don't want to force things and make a mistake here. The kick's away. Fielded at the eight-yard line. Makes the return up to the 48. The home team needs to get their act together on defense. 
They'll need a big turnover or a quick stop to try and shift the momentum back in their favor. The second quarter comes to a close. Dallas leading 13-3. Long sends it off. Snyder catches the kickoff. And he's brought down after a return of 24. Let's check in with our sideline reporter, Emma Adams. <coughs> Emma, what can you tell us? Thanks, Dave. I had a chance to speak to the coach for the Gators. Their passing attack in the first half was described as needing significant improvement. If they want to end up on top at the end of this game, they'll need to be more consistent in the air. Back to you. Thanks for that, Emma. Soto dropping back. He throws one deep right. Washington pulls it in. Good enough for a first down. Nice route and pass to pick up the first down there. <laughs> he launches one. He snags it out of the air for the touchdown. In college or high school, that pass is not considered open. But in Axis, that little separation is all these guys need to put up six. It's good. Dallas widens their lead. 23. That's a big score for the offense. Flores kicks it. Schwartz takes the kickoff. He's brought down after a return of 31. The offense has dug themselves into quite a hole here. They've got a chance to regain some of that on this drive. Hanson makes the reception. Good enough for a first down. The defense is just looking around at each other. Nobody was willing to risk a finger to tip that pass, I suppose. Schwartz makes the completion. And he steps in for six. Touchdown. With such a small part of the field to work with and a tight window to throw it through, that throw had to be perfect. It's good. Louisiana eats away at the lead a bit. 20, 10. Their faces aren't as long with that score, Dave, but it's still not been the way they drew this up. There looks to be an injury down on the field. He's brought down after a return of 24. The home team needs to get their act together on defense. They'll need a big turnover or a quick stop to try and shift the momentum back in their favor. Soto with the toss. Second down. Quarterback to pass. Louisiana bringing pressure. Snyder makes the reception. He crosses the goal line. Touchdown. That was a great short strike into the end zone for the touchdown. The kick is up. Just barely missed it. Dallas extends their lead. 26-10. This is when it's fun for an offense. You extend this lead and the game just starts to flow. Schwartz catches the kickoff. He's brought down after a return of 33. The home team needs to get something going on this drive. The defense sends men on the blitz. He scores! I'll tell you, these two work on that in practice all the time. They could do this in their sleep, but it sure gives the defense nightmares. It's good! Louisiana bridges the gap a bit. 26-17. The away team would do well to execute a nice, long drive here that would really take the wind out of the sails from this score. Makes the return up to the 34. The home team needs to get their act together on defense. They'll need a big turnover or a quick stop to try and shift the momentum back in their favor. He makes the pitch. Second down. Green one! Green one! Go! Pitches it out to number 46. And he crosses the goal line for a touchdown. This is big boy football. The defense might consider getting some new guys in because they just got manhandled. It's good! Dallas adds to their score, 33-17.
They just keep pouring it on, Dave. But that's the competitiveness of this league. You can't let off the throttle. And he's brought down after a return of 33. So much of football is mental. The offense needs to get a score in this drive to build some confidence. Intercepted by number 39. The coach already has the clipboard out. You can Set. bet he's going to go over this mistake go. right away. The home team needs to get their act together on defense. They'll need a big turnover or a quick stop to try and shift the momentum back in their favor. That brings up second down. Boy, Dave, you talk uh. about a bullet pass. That ball could have been pulled over mid-flight. Do you know how fast you were going there, son? Hike! Passes one to the back. First down. Being able to move the ball in the running game, especially, especially when you can pick up a first down, gives you so many options and terms on play calling. The third quarter comes to an end. The away team with the edge so far, 33-17. He drops back to pass, makes the throw, and he misses his mark. The away team is really having a hard time holding on to the ball today with these passes. Soto tosses one out, finally stopped by Blair, and he scores! That was a great call by the coach and great Go. execution by the players. It's good! Dallas adds to their score, 40-17. You give up more points here, and you almost don't want to walk back to the sidelines to hear it from the coaches. Schwartz catches the kickoff. Tackled after a return of 30. So much of football is mental. The offense needs to get a score in this drive to build some confidence if they want any shot of coming back in this game. He's brought down by Long. We can see some jawing going on between those two on the last play, Dave. The wideout definitely looking to get the best of that matchup. Dallas accepts the penalty. Mental errors are a huge part of the game. This one just creeps up pre-play for us all to see. Hey. Steps into the pocket. Setting up the screen over the middle. He can't bring it in. There is a flag on the play. The away team will accept the penalty. Move them back a few more yards. You can console the guys that teammate all you want, but it's going to frustrate those guys. Fisher with the catch. That brings up third down. That ball was really slung in there, Dave. The receiver did a great job holding on to it for the catch. Makes a hard throw. Brought down at the 37. That'll bring up fourth down. Everyone was covered up by the first down line. The only option they had was to check down for a shorter completion and hope the receiver could make a few people miss. The punt will sail into the end zone. Touchback. The home team needs to get their act together on defense. They'll need a big turnover or a quick stop to try and shift the momentum back in their favor. The runner steps out of bounds, close to the 34-yard line. That'll be enough for the first down. Number 46 on the run. First down. Soto tosses one out. Finally taken down by Hunt. And that's enough for a first down. You know, Dave, you can only go from first down to first down so many times before it turns into points on the board. Tackle made, Louisiana uses their first time out. A penalty marker on the play. Throws one, oh, and it's intercepted. We'll see if the penalty affects the outcome. Dallas will accept the penalty. Traditional wisdom puts the blame for penalties on the coaches. The running back. It's a fumble. Brought down almost immediately by Fleming. Louisiana calls their second timeout. That gets us to second down. 
It's caught for the score. This receiver, such a good wingspan. He's got the ability to get that ball Go. even when the ball isn't perfectly passed. It's good. Dallas widens their lead, 47-17. We've talked about it a few times, Dave. They're really playing a complete game this go-round. Schwartz catches the kickoff. Tackled after a return of 35. It needs to be go time for the offense. They need to stop messing around. Tighten up your chin strap and get ready to drive the ball down the field. He can't make the catch. Green three, green three, set. Tonight. He steps back to pass. Throws a heater. Third down. The defense is just looking around at each other. Nobody was willing Tonight. to risk a finger to tip that pass, I suppose. Throws the ball. That will bring up first down. Being able to convert first downs in the passing game makes your running game that much easier to execute. Brought down around the 41. That will move the chains. Go! Throws. Fisher pulls it in. And that's enough for a first down. A good first down for the defense is an incomplete pass or a short run, not another first down. I guess they didn't get the memo. <laughs> Setting up the screen near the middle of the field. Incomplete pass. <laughs> Number nine, dropping back. He launches one. Off. It's caught for the score. As a receiver, when you're close to the goal line, your route running becomes even more important because the defender knows you have limited options for where you can run. Excellent job there. And it's good. Louisiana eats away at the lead a bit. 47-24. Their faces aren't as long with that score, Dave, but it's still not been the way they drew this up. And the receiving team will safely fall on the ball. Tonight, the away team should focus on time of possession here. Keep the ball away from the other team. Drag this game out. Louisiana will call their third and their final Fight. timeout here. Second down. Boy, Dave, you talk about a bullet pass. That ball could have been pulled over mid-flight. Do you know how fast you were going there, son? <laughs> Throws it along the left side. Picked off. Hunt made a real heads-up play there, Dave. He got his hands up just at the right time. The defense has a chance to come up big. If they can force a punt after that turnover, it'll give the entire team a boost of confidence. Second down. Tonight. He steps back to pass. Fires a rocket. He's brought down. That brings up third down. That brings an end to the game, and time for us to take a look at the Mike Steele stun of the game. Mike, who are you thinking had the most impact today? Number 46 for the away team. Made the whole team better today and earned my stud award. Talk about a guy that loves football. It really showed on the field today.